guys, welcome back to my channel. Glad you're here. Just uh, stop right now. Make sure you go over and hit that thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed yet, please consider that. Um, I've gotten a lot of comments on my videos. Uh, they do like my hat. And everybody seems to know what that means except for one person. Uh, and they do like my shirt. So this is my newest one. So I figured I'd just show that off. So let's get to what the video is about. <clears throat> so for Christmas, um, my family, my wife and my kids, they all, they chipped in and uh, they got me another family member, another gun. It's been in the house for a while because with New York State laws, I have to purchase the gun. I have to put it under my concealed carry weapons, uh, concealed carry gun license. And uh, so I just, I had to wait till Christmas to actually put it in my hands. I did cheat a couple of times and took it out of the box and, you know. But, this is what it is. Now, the, the, the gun is safety checked. I'll do it again just to show the magazines over here for all the uh, safety police out there. This is a Rock Island 45 ACP 1911. Love the uh, color, that, that dark, like, OD green. Um, it has, like, Novak style rear sight and just a blade in the front, which I think uh, I will change out to some kind of um, better sight. Um, <clears throat> it has the skeletonized hammer and trigger, an extended beaver tail, a uh, grip safety, manual safety here. Um, the grips on here are very aggressive, but they don't hurt. And I, I really like the way it feels. This gun will never slip out of your hand. You never have to worry about that. But look at the, the texturing on that. I don't know if you can really tell, but you'd have to hold it to really tell what it is. Um, like I said, I, haven't, I only got it for Christmas, which is a couple of days ago. Um, a video will be coming out on range day when I do take this to the range and shoot it. Um, I do have the Judge, which is 45 Long Colt, so I, I can expect what the recoil is going to be. Um, but I think from all the reviews I've watched about this, recoil is really not bad because it's such a heavy gun. Um, I will be carrying this where goes against a lot of people saying that it's too heavy to carry um, for me my body size and type it, it, it's never really that bad and I used to for this I'll probably use a um, the belly band holster to see how it fits in there and then down the road maybe uh, I will order a um, in the waistband holster just to see how that works um, I really do like the palm safety, uh, and I do like the other safety that it has. Now, a lot of people say, well, you don't need all these safeties. The best safety is to keep your finger off the trigger. I agree with that, but having these other safeties is just another way to keep you safe because how is it? It'll never shoot. I mean, you cannot pull the trigger. See, when the hammer's back, you cannot pull the trigger. Now, when you put your hand on the palm safety, that's when it would go. So, in order for this to mistakenly go off, you'd have to have this depressed and the trigger at the same time. Kind of hard to, to think that that would happen. I'm sure uh, it has happened somewhere or could happen. For me, it wouldn't. Um, I would. I would definitely. Uh, I wouldn't keep this cocked, where they say that's how you should carry this. Because it's a single double action, and if you had to use this in self-defense, you'd have to pull it out and cock it back. I'm hoping that I never have to use it, so, you know, I, I'll just leave it in normal. When I carry it, I'll carry it just like this, and God forbid I do need it. It's not going to be like, uh, you know, something from the West where I got to draw fast. Um, in some, in most cases, God forbid you need to use it, you'd have time to cock it and everything. I, I, I believe that. So, 
Yeah. So yeah, look out for the video uh, for the range day. This will be highlighted in that in the video there. I hope you enjoy that series. It's uh, I got videos still out to like this uh, January twenty eighth or something like that. So be, I'll be adding more because I do have to shoot the uh, AR fifteen that I built um, or put together. Um, so yeah, stay tuned for that. Hope you enjoyed this. Don't forget to hit that thumbs up and subscribe. And stay tuned for more, guys.